cabbage, carrots, thyme, nettle, and cranberries, along with the Celtic sea salt. And one more thing I'm gonna do, I'm gonna go out in the garden and get a little piece of green onion. So I have not yet found my fermenting lids. I know they're here somewhere. So I'm using a coffee filter and an elastic band to hold this together. And there is a glass pushing the covering leaves over top of the sauerkraut. It smells really good right now. We'll see what it looks like in a few days. Okay, y'all, some things to know. Coffee filters with an elastic band mm -hmm. on top of one of these jars works fine if you don't have a fermenter lid. I've transferred the sauerkraut to a smaller jar, and I just wanna let you know the flavor of this is incredible. So I had put thyme, carrots, nettle, and um, the cranberries into this with a little bit of onion from, green onion from out in the garden. Mm. It's sweet and sour at the same time is so good. All right, I'll put the recipe below this. Please let me know if you didn't try it and happy holidays till the next video.